Okay, so Reverse Stage is a thing that just came out on Global, and I see a lot of people asking me to show how to beat the stages. Um, honestly, I'm going to be very blunt right now. There isn't a cheat way to beat the stages. And you will see because if you try to beat them right now, you're probably not going to be able to get all the stars. Here's the thing. This is not a... Oh, the activity just dropped, let me finish it, and maybe there's going to be a reset. No, this is something that you work towards beating as you build up your box. So, what I'm saying right now is, if you can't beat all of it, eventually you will, so do not worry. You don't have to rush it, especially because the rewards, honestly, for how difficult the activity is, are not even worth it. Uh, it should be rushed, right? You get like 15 gems and 3 part shoot tickets, but the part shoot tickets are great, don't get me wrong. But right now, honestly, I think you shouldn't even be using them. You might, it might be worth waiting for a derriere uh, to be added to the part shoot tickets uh, on global, right? So do not worry about rushing it. And as much as I want to call this a guide, this is not a guide. This is just me beating the stages, okay? <laughs> if you want some point of reference, good. But this is not a guide because you need level 80 units to beat some of these, right? Not all of them. A, a few of them are just easier than others. So a lot of, a lot of them, you don't need like full on level 80 units. But because I have been playing the game for so long, I have lots of R's and SR's level 80. And I can't just unrank them to beat the stage again, right? So you have to deal with me actually using my units. There are higher level and i'm gonna put this at the beginning of every single one of these videos because i want to make this a disclaimer so you don't complain in the comments <laughs> and also because it's very important for you to know i'll be beating all of this for each individual video that i put out and i'll start with the most simple one which is this one it only has six stars um but again very big disclaimer this is not a um, a guide because you need level 80 units and you don't need to rush it. Complete this as you can. All right, I'll cut this right now because I'm going to put this in the beginning of every video. Um, so you, you know, okay. Okay, so for our first video here, I will be doing these two right here, which are very simple. Um, I mean, you need these units leveled up, of course. I do recommend that you bring up red slater and not blue slater. If you don't have Red Slayer leveled up, you can bring Blue Slayer, but I do actually recommend him. And you don't have options for the other ones. Um, one thing that I would, you know, say, you don't have to level up Ruin, he is going to be a fourth unit. You can't move these around, I'm pretty sure, yeah, you can't move them. But I do recommend either si at least 60 him and 70 him. Like, this guy is actually pretty okay, so it's not even a, that worse of a, as a, a material thing, material waste. Uh, and 6-star whoever you can. 6-star him, 6-star him, 6-star him, and you should be good. I will not be using food, but um, either recommend using CP food, because a mission is for you to get over the CP requirement. So if you can't get over the CP requirement, use CP food, do whatever you can. If you can't even do all 3 stars, I don't even recommend being the stage. I mean, actually, okay, I, I wouldn't for you to get, like, you won't get all the rewards, but... Ace move, you know, towards getting the rewards. Uh, this is uh, for no one to die, and I'm pretty sure this is uh, to beat this within eight eight turns. So let's beat it uh, again. Red Slater, all, Red Slater in general is better than Blue Slater, but I would say actually, mm, is this the stage I'm thinking about that Blue Slater is actually really good? No, okay. There is a stage, but I don't recall if it's reverse stage. I think it is one of the reverse stages, I don't know. That blue slater is really good. Oh, you can't target them. Oh, you can. Why are they invisible? Okay. Um, let me go for this. This and this and combine these two cards. Again, the, for these stages, you know, leveling up the units is what really matters. So, don't feel bad if you can't just beat them, you know, first day. Chances are you, you just won't. <laughs> these are... Uh, Pretty difficult. And that's why I brought Red Slater. So Bond can't um can't uh, snatch you. It's very good. Alright. I think this disables stance as well. So I will attack Meliodas right there. But I'm still gonna continue moving to kill Bond. You wanna kill one at a time. So you reduce their uh, their attacks and stuff. Don't wanna be uh, you know, 
moving from target to target. Although I'd prefer if I could have used, you know, an ultimate or something. I should have rushed an ultimate with Slayer, but it's okay. Unfortunately, I only got like an extra card for a Simon, which wasn't very good. Alright, Bond's dead. Um, because of that, I'm gonna do this. Because that will weaken him. And it'll do this. And that will give me Simon's ultimate and Slayer's ultimate. And they should kill Bond as well. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Well, I should use the attack weakening on the King, so, uh, you know, he doesn't hit that hard. Because he's definitely going for that kill. But as you could, as you could see, I worked on get yeah. Ooh. Funny, the, the first time I beat this, the one that gave me trouble was Bond, and that's why I went for him first. But I guess this time it wasn't interesting. So yeah, now I can use the ults. That's why I worked. I didn't even use um, Arrow Boy because I, I really wanted to work towards getting the ults for uh, Slater and Simon. Uh, because, you know, true green units is best like this. The stage is pretty much done. Interesting. The first time I beat this, like I said, the one to give me trouble was Bon. It wasn't King. That's why I'm actually... Uh, I think this is pretty interesting. Okay, I won't attack with Arrow Boy because he's probably gonna die, and you do, like you can't have any that dies. You can't have any that die, or else you just miss the the one of the missions, right? So it's best that it's best that even even if you have to try multiple times, it's best that you do instead of letting any that die. You know, All right, this stage is pretty much done. I'm just gonna have to make sure I don't attack with Arrow Boy. Um, please give me other cards, not not only his. Please, uh, not even if I, if I do. Oh, he didn't have a counter up on stupid. It, it, it doesn't matter. I wanted to level troops later anyways, because um, then it would super weaken him. But yeah, this is done. I'm gonna go to the other stage now. Okay, so this other stage, um, this one's harsh. I will not be using any like super awakened characters because we can't do this on global, right? Like as links uh, for my characters, I would just bu just be putting some level 80s. But this stage, I, I tried doing this with no links. I don't even think it's possible. Like this stage is actually pretty difficult. I, I mean, it, it probably if you get good RNG, it can be much easier. But I think you will need at least to 80 Simon, which is not even a bad 80. You can use him as a link for uh, for um, Slater for a Hell Red Demon, and. You might need to 80 Weinhardt as well. Weinhardt is a big one because you can attack seal. Yeah, this stage is rough. So, gonna have to push for ults. Let me try to get. I'm not doing this card because I'm actually gonna wait for uh, Weinhardt to get another, another card. This wasn't the attack seal. But it's good enough. Um, yeah, th this stage is harsh. I'm telling you right now, this stage is harsh. It's gonna break a card. Which one is it? Oh no no no! Go for breaks a card. Sorry. Yeah. Okay, that's good. Bond got the ult, and as you can see, like you see how much life steal they have. They just fully healed pretty much. I'm attack seal, and then I'll just attack go for regularly. They just pretty much fully healed with life steal. This stage is harsh. All right. Oh no. Uh, so long as he doesn't die, it's okay. If someone dies, you have to repeat. We took off my, my ultimate gauge, though. Okay, I can't attack with him. Nah, this is not attack to me, is it? No. This is stand silly. Damn. Yeah, I already lost. This stage is harsh. Like, legitimately way too difficult for the characters that they make you use. Like, they... They're not as tanky. Like, Simon, as you can see, is doing good damage. Um... Because he has type advantage, but doesn't matter because White Heart is gonna die. He has type disadvantage. Yep, and I have to reset. This age is harsh. Be uh, be careful with this one. So actually, I, I was going to use Life Steal, but I think I'm gonna go with Attack Third. I think the best strategy to use is to rush Simon's ultimate for the second turn, and because he has an AOE ult, right? If you can rush his ultimate, so I think you might need to get like an extra card for him. I'm gonna try to do it if I don't get it. But you might need to get an extra card for Simon and, and rush his AoE ultimate. Oh, good. Not, the, not perfect, but good. Uh, I can do... 
I'll, 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 attack, I'll not even attack Bond, because I know he's going to fully heal. I'm going to attack like this. And then hope that I get to Simon cards again next turn and, and get his ultimate. I think that's the only way to be. Because I, I, it's been a while since I did beat it. This is my kill. Go for it. No. It's been a Oh, attack. That was the attack so card. Yeah, okay. I got the, the ultimate. It's been a while since I beat it. So I don't really recall what I did. But this this must have been there. Because, like, I, 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 I entered this stage... And I was thinking to try again, right? Before recording. And I was thinking, um, oh, this, this, must not, this must not be so hard, right? Because they're making you use, like, trash characters. That's how it works, right? Nope. This one's rough. I, I'm beating them right now. But I'm telling you, you're gonna need some idiots. Like, Simon, I would recommend. Because, you see, like, he was, he was, like, the MVP for damage. Because he's red, and all the enemies are green. So getting his um, his ult, definitely helpful. Definitely. Helpful. I got very lucky on this run, because I got a lot of, a lot of uh, cards for him. So I would say for this stage in particular, you might need to AD Simon for it. Um, attack food was good. Maybe ult, ult food, if you want to ult rush. And Weinhardt might also need some high levels because, um, because, um, or else he will die very fast. This guy should be okay because you're using Vivian and she gives him HP. So for tanking, he should be okay. Like level 60 with five, six stars, it should be fine. But I think Simon and Weinhardt, th I mean, these two characters you should level up for the other stage as well. So I guess these two stages go hand in hand. This one, like, for the first video, I chose one of the hardest ones. But some of the other stages aren't as hard. Like, the Twiggo one is pretty easy. So that's it for this one. Uh, good luck uh, trying to beat it yourself. Again, if you can beat it now, don't worry. You have a long time. It took them a while to release Season 2. And this is still up on GP, right? You can beat this anytime you want. Season 2 came out and he had the pretty much same awards. Um, and it was a little more, ah, uh, for me it wasn't difficult because I already have all my years like leveled up, but uh, it was pretty much the same difficulty, I'd say. So, uh, level up your characters at your own pace, uh, do anything you have to, but don't worry about it, you don't have to rush it, alright, that's it.